This is a Boss 202 loop station. It's pretty awesome. One of the best investments I've ever made. So dope. Because I don't even know what instruments those were. But, uh, you know, because there's lots of them. You got some pianos, you know, bass. Uh, lots of stuff. Okay. Anyway, I thought I'd just like to show you maybe some of the things I've made. I wrote down a few of the ones I looked through that weren't absolute trash, and then maybe I'll sort through, and we'll just see some of the garbage, too, even. Why not? Right? Okay. So, I don't know what the audio quality is going to be like. Probably garbage, like always. Okay, so, expectations low. Uh, you got that one. Which I'm not really sure what that is. I think at that point in time, because I'm just looking at when the memory of these saves are, and I think I was using this thing, which is actually kind of cool. I'll show this too. I'm, uh, this is my first little DIY project uh, synthesizer you had to put together. I solder all that stuff. This thing actually sounds really cool, especially if you use this or um, a processor pedal with it. You can make some really cool sounds. Okay, uh, let's see here. We are going to go to. Another dimension, maybe. Oh, okay, four, four. So the way that the loop station works too is super awesome. If you're not familiar with an instrument like this, basically, well, I, okay, that's boring to look at that, right? Okay, so basically like with an instrument like this, it, and I do call it an instrument for sure because you can do so much with it. Like you can filter effects when you put them into the loop station, you can filter the effects after you've created a track and it's coming out, you can layer tracks to the point where you can live, you know, create a song and then alter it while you're playing it, kind of like a DJ. It's great. So there's lots of uh, really cool stuff you can do with it. And yeah, okay. So, all right, that's that. All right, let's see here. So let's hear this one. I don't know. I wrote down 4-4, four, four, so maybe it's good or not. Let's hear. It's loud, that's for sure. All right, so we got to quiet it down. I would say this sounds like uh, final boss music or something. But you know, you see, you got your first track going here. That's the first loop. And you got my second track, which I don't know. I probably used maybe one of the uh, synthesizers or pianos or something for. What else do we have here? Oh god, I'm sorry if this is terribly boring and this is awful. Just let me know and I'll never make something like this again. Or I'll actually edit things, maybe. I feel like all my music sounds like video game music, but not intentionally. So, uh, that I would say is probably... There, this song is probably cut from... I don't know. Okay, we'll do. Let's just do one more, and then I'll just show a cool instrument. Maybe. How about that? All right. So what do we got? Three seven. So you have to press this memory button to change the setting of like the this first uh, memory, and then the second part. I don't know. Fuck. Never mind. I'm not gonna explain it. Okay. So let's see here. What did I say? Three seven. Okay. Maybe this will be good. Or not. Oh, this is tight. Pretty chill, huh? Alright, anyway, so that's that. I guess let's uh, just do a little quick... If you're still sticking around, it's almost four minutes. Let's make this five. And you're just looking at random shit in my room, so I could pan around a little bit. There's this. Nice. There's this dinner that my lovely go girlfriend made for me. If I had FL Studio and, like, some nice MIDI cables, maybe I'd actually put some of these together and make a song, but I don't have that. Here's this nice little drum pad I got. Been getting in touch with that, so to speak. I got... I think I want to find my cool instrument. Little, little cool instrument I got. Fuck me. Let's see here. Oh, here's a little TV I made into an oscilloscope. That's cool. Here we go. Oh yeah, my first project, but my pride and joy. I'm the best Barney guitar player in this entire world. And that is a fact. This turns it on. 
This gives a little choppy sound. Uh, these knobs do other mystical stuff. You know? So, maybe someday I'll make another video with this.